Let's come here. Why do I have a sword mark there? Uh, it's probably a chest, but I have no idea what's inside. Well, it's a weapon. Oops, I that. I have no idea. Mm, so far, nothing. Can I see the moon yet? Mm, does it mean it's going to be a blood moon or not? Because there's sun setting to the other side, and this one is red. Uh, I think that means a blood moon. Today, there's a third over there. So let's go take a picture. And now, uh, I don't need the money. But should I try to get some money there or try to bring it to a stable? I think it responds. So I can blast it before and then take it away. Carrying one of the boopies and everybody will run away. <laughs> Just that I like to take a decent picture. Ah, from here. That's also a nice sniping position. Lord of the Mountain. This noble creature watches over all animals that make their homes in the forest. Legends say this holy creature is a reincarnation of a sage that died on the lands and now protects. It has an acute awareness of its surroundings, so it seldom appears before people. It's sometimes known for its, uh, by its other name, Satori. Okay, so now... This is kind of mean. Do I have a 5 arrow? No. So it's going to be 3. And it's going to be bombs. And now. Okay, so Satori doesn't drop any money. But let's. I'll count that towards how much money I got. Oh, 
That was good. Uh, is there more already? No blood moon today. I think there is response. So I'm not sure. I think I saw you respawning once. They are burn marks on the ground from where those decay guardians were. So they shot other things that came around over time from the, those positions. No, it's just a regular moon. Damn. I'm gonna go. Yeah, I'm going for the fairy tale quest. And see if there is a blood moon around that. Here. Oh, I didn't even see it. Not anymore. Oh, come on, guys. Oh, here. jump back on like a color okay it isn't it's still oh it started raining so I guess I'm not grabbing that card now yeah you're gonna have to wait gonna be more
right. That shows our progress better. Hey. Ooh. Hey. We meet again. Who are you again? I'm one of Bolsa's construction contractors. The name is Hudson. I remember. <laughs> Me too. Oh, what are you doing? Since I've been transferred here, I decided to build a village from scratch. Every village needs a name, though. I think I'll call it Terry Town. Good idea. However, what's wrong? Mm. I built a house to store the village's supplies, but to start village supplies in. But there just isn't enough. Enough what? Enough anything. People, money, stuff. I'll help out. But why? There's nothing in it for you. I don't mind. You're a lifesaver. Well, I suppose to get started we'll need houses for people to live in. We can invite them until we have homes. You think you can bring me 10 bundles of wood? If you bring me that, I can combine it with what I've already got and get started on new houses. Okay, here they are. Hello? Do you bring them? Excellent, can I have them? Sure. Your lifesaver. Well, next is... Uh -huh. These bowlers are driving me nuts. I want to move them out of the way so we can develop the land underneath. Uh, it really helped me out if you could find someone with enough brute physical strength to bust them apart. Physical strength? Mm. Yeah, if we are talking about brute physical strength, and we are, a girl will be my first choice. Good luck, you need it. This seems like a real long shot. Oh, and one last wrinkle. Yeah, in accordance with the official postal construction policy, that someone's name must end in sun. If you run to someone, if you want run into anyone that fits with what I've said, send them here to Terry Town for me. Okay, let's take a look at the first house before. And now I'm missing a stone smasher picture. The second tire Goro storage. Okay, so there's Goro. Uh, damn, there isn't anything close to it, is there? Uh, I think here a bit closer. And I'm gonna have to change clothes. Can you see here? Damn, why can't I use it? Oh, well, it's night, so there aren't gonna be any birds around. I'm not sure about butterflies because I need smothering butterflies. Oh, here maybe? No. Huh? Oh, I don't think I need any more of those. But... So. Uh, oh, okay, I found it. Hmm. 
Oh, I don't have a bow equipped. I I broke the one I had. Oh, it wasn't my intention. <laughs> I I don't think I ever got one. I didn't know they instantly exploded. Makes sense. Right? <laughs> Interesting. There may be a park there as well. Oh, this guy's still working. That's nice. Uh, what the heck? At this hour, I'm a traveler. Huh. I'll give it to you straight. Why his eyes don't play tricks? I said I'm a traveler. Huh. Fine then, keep your secrets. If there's something you wanna ask me, what's this place? As you can see, this is a mine. We sell the ore we put on the ground, our home, we're gonna see props on that. We use mine summon, but there is a monster launch, those mine it is anymore. You decided to make most of the digging here. Anything else for you? Born of Golden City, I was once young and strong, now I'm old and wrinkled. Or not, there's still a lot of fight left in me. Anything else? No. What's he talking about? The chicest leech? Because I am actually a traveler, but I had the option to say something else. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> Interesting. Uh, who is who? Grayson. Come on, I'm a break. What is it? And you are? I'm Grayson. I'm a digger here, as you can see. And I dig and dig, day in and day out. To be honest, I'm sick of it. I feel like maybe I'm not meant to throw away in obscurity like this. Is there a job out there for me that let me use my strength to make a difference? There is. Hmm? There is? Where? Please tell me more. Terry Town. Terry Town. Never heard of it. What's the deal with that place? Hmm. Mm, Akala. Terry Town. So, there is someone out, somewhere out there that needs me. Uh, Akala isn't too far from here. Alright. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna strike while the iron is hot. Uh -huh. Thanks for letting me know, brother. Palace and I are gonna head there right away. While I'm at Palace, oh! we're gonna leave. It's you. As you can see, I'm working real hard. Let's some praise me at town for breaking these rocks. We're finding some nice art too. My little brother Pelison even started an art shop. Check it out when you get a chance. Welcome. Hey, big bro Grayson's friend. Need something? Let's talk. Sure, that sounds fun. What do you want to talk about? This place? Once we started breaking up the rock here, we found that it's rich in art. So I decided to open up shop. I'm not sure why we have so much art here, but maybe it's because we're close to that mountain. 
Anyway, these here are freshly mined, so be sure to buy a whole bunch. Want to something else? Turn it down. It's so cold here. Or maybe it's a, just that Goron City is too hot. Want to something else? Where's Grayson? My brother should be somewhere around here. He's so much happier than he was at the Southern Mine. He gets praised a ton for how fast he can move rocks. I'm sure that makes him extra happy. So else? Goodbye. Good day. I'm here. Get down. That's so rude. Hurry up and get down. Please stop climbing on things. And their house. Well, maybe not their house. Yeah, maybe it is their house. you on the same rock. Ooh. Hey, you sent some Gorons back here. That's perfect. The brute strength of a Goron is undeniable. Those boulders don't stand a chance against them. And with names like Greystone and Pelisson, they'll fit right in. Also, Pelisson started selling the ore farm within the boulders. You should go say hello again. Mm. Well, next is... Uh -huh. So, before more people can move here, we need homes for them to live in. Can you bring me 20 bottles of wood? If you bring me that, I can combine it with what I've already got and get started on new homes. Hello, you bring 20, broaden. Excellent, can I have a sure? Her life saver. Well, next is. Mm -hmm. Working such long hours every day really wears on my clothes. Could you look for someone who's got a gift? for tailoring for me. Tailoring. Mm. If we're talking about tailoring, there could be someone among the Gerudo who's good at that. Good luck. You need it. This seems like a real long shot. Uh, and one less wrinkle. Yeah, in accordance, to, in accordance with the official boss of construction policy, that someone's name must end is Sun. That person didn't have to be hired by boss of construction. It's just gonna provide you a service, not the whole company. If you run someone that fits you, that's what I said, then send it, send it here to their town for me. So let's grab... Hanson. It's gonna be hot, so we we'll use. I don't need uh, the other boots. I'll just grab a seal here. <gasps> Birds! I thought I heard something. It doesn't have to be a good picture. It just has to be a picture. Come on, I'm so close. Did it work? Damn! I'll... It's so hard to get a picture of them. I think that was the last thing I had for my companion uh, when I played on regular mode. Oh, come on. And I never thought I would try to complete the companion again. Sabota. 
essa nota. I'm still considering how to continue my search. I mastered tailoring. I have dozens of other skills. I just don't understand what I, what Vo are looking for. I wonder if there really is someone out there for me. Go to Terry Town. Eh? What is it? So abrupt too. Let me hear the details. Hudson in Terry Town is a tailor. It's something, I suppose. The Akala region is kind of far away, but maybe I need to travel, getting far away from a village full of eye. But it's not like I'm accomplishing anything by staying here. I can continue my search in Terry Town. Thanks for all the information. I'm gonna go home and pack a huge bag. It'll be a long journey all the way there. I'll no doubt see you again in Terry Town. There's any birds around here, are there? Let me decide those. I mean the sparrows. the new house Ah, is the family here already? Yes, they're here already And there's gonna be a quest here Good morning do you need something for me? What's the matter? Our daughter has been on poor, in poor health lately. My husband believed that moving here could help, so he bought a house. <laughs> I do like it here. The air, seen, the air is clean. There aren't too many people. Despite my husband's determination, I wasn't sure if a move was a good idea. But our daughter is slowly improving. Mm. The only thing left is for her appetite to return. I'm sure she get well faster to shape more. Uh, mm. And I, I got to ask Papa for advice again. Ooh. Okay, so that's bad for them. Dog later after completing it. Hey, we found someone from Gerudo. Thanks. Oh, I have to spoke big for She was able to patch every last hole in my work clothes before I could blink. She's pretty uh, amazing. And since her name's Ronson, I have no objections. I hear she's decided to continue putting her skill to use by opening a clothing shop. You should stop by and say hello. Our well, next is uh -huh. so before more people can move in, we need more homes for them to live in. Can you bring me 30 bundles of wood? Should bring me bring me that? I can't combine it, but I got all right, all right, same thing, same thing. Ooh. Hello, bring broad, excellent, sure, mm. have saver. Mm. Well next is uh -huh. it's finally starting to look like a tower on here, which is exactly why we need to set up some distribution. I like to get a general store up and running, but there's no one in the connections with the connections and qualifications to run it. Do you think you could keep an eye out for someone who knows about distribution and can run a general store? So a traveling trader? Mm. Oh, that's a good thought. Rito can fly around, so they should be able to retrieve and deliver supplies while flying. Carrying heavy loads. Good luck, you need it. This seems like a real long shot. Oh, and one last wrinkle. Yeah, in accordance with the uh, official boss construction policy, this is that someone's name must end in sun. 
He's gonna move in and open a general store. He doesn't have to work for Bolsa. If you run join one the fish with, with that what I said, send the turtle for me. Okay, let's check on Ronson. So they are probably sharing this home already. Since the couple moved there. Sag, do you need some for me? Uh, Savak. <laughs> you should say Savota now. Uh, do you, don't you remember me? I'm Ronson. I had to make Hudson's work clothes every single day. It's impressive how quickly he wears them out. <sighs> Besides the holes, they reek so much of sweat, it's actually pretty rough to work on them. I tried to bring it up to him, but he got defensive almost immediately. You know, I came out, out here to continue my search for a husband. I wonder if he's the only kind of vow I'll find. And she ended up getting together with him. Uh, I, th I think I'm not gonna talk to that guy yet, because he's probably gonna give me the quest as soon as I talk to him. Hey, morning. I'm glad Meadow has settled down, but I have bigger problems. My mom says she wants me to take over the family store someday. Can you believe that? I don't want to just help. I want to open my own store and sell whatever I want. Well, her mother wants him to take over, not to help, but to own the store. Mm. But I don't want to compete with mom. I wish there was a place I could set up my own shop. Heard of Terrytown? Mm. Terrytown? Tell me more. Oh, so they're in need of a general star, that's perfect. But the Akala region, that's pretty far out there. But I guess I've got to leave the nest someday. And to have my own star. <laughs> okay, I made up my mind. I'm going. I know, I'll gather some items on the way to Terrytown and sell them at my new shop. Thanks for the tip. And hey, don't be a stranger. Come visit me at my new home sometime. I think if Medo is still around, he he mentions he's gonna have to fly low. I think. Oh. Okay. That was there. Is granted there already. Uh, he isn't here yet. Uh, hang on, this is. Oh, uh, one bed home. Uh, so now there are Hi. more people here. Good morning. Yeah. And who might you be? I'm just a traveler. Oh, is that so? By the way, I don't suppose you came to Terry Town to purchase a holiday home, did you? Uh, no. Oh, is that so? Anyway, please be careful. My husband's taking great care of this area. Uh, 
but there seems to be a lot of strange folks just outside of town. Ah. There's something and strange things. Strange plants and guys with ugly faces live just outside the village. There are a lot of them, right? Ah, she's talking about Kilton and the fairy. Uh, especially the big flower that's to the southeast of Terry Town. I was chatting with my husband about how there's a huge flower out there. You really shouldn't mess with things you don't understand. Shout out on sales, strange things, big flowers, so that's... Uh, okay. Her husband. Oh, it's gotten warm, hasn't it? Oh, what do we have here? Looks like we have another youngling in town. Who are you? I'm called Mox. My son is grown up and I'm retired. So when I heard a rumor about Terry Town, <laughs> just had to move here. And I'm glad I did. My pet seems much happier here too. Pets. So the dog was yours? He wasn't here before. Anyway, come back and chat with me again sometime. So... I guess the girls were kicked out of the free house. Maybe they don't have a home. Hey, what can I get you? Hey, hey, it's been a while. <laughs> Remember me, Faison. After I left Ruth Village, some bandits tried to mug me. Look for me, they didn't have wings. Terratown is really great. Nice weather, no moms to annoy me. <laughs> it's really great being able to run my own shop and sell the things that I want to sell. Anyway, I'm open for business, so shop to your heart's content. Okay, I. You don't care? I don't care if you're paying customer. I can't let you climb in there. This is a place of business, not a gym. <laughs> Please, get down. Okay. Take them all. Okay. Oh, I have. Yeah, I should start using other arrows <laughs> instead of the regular ones. Just because I have so many. Ooh. Hey, you managed to find a Rito in bringing him back here. Thank you. He wasted no time getting a general store up and running. Apparently, his family runs one too. And with a name like Faison, he'll fit right in. He's selling things that he's picking up while flying around. You should really go check, check out the store. Mm. So, you see, all he could carry was arrows and those gears that even float on water. Next season, huh? So, before we can call more people here, we need even more homes for them. Can you bring me 50 bundles of wood? Bring me that, I can combine. Okay. Ooh. Hello, bring 50, I brought them. Excellent, sure. Yellow saver. I actually wanted to talk, you, talk about something a little personal. What's wrong? Oh, not that kind of personal. Actually, I got engaged. No way. It's true. To who? To Ronson. What a surprise. You say that, but for some reason, I think you mean the opposite. Anyway, we want to have a little ceremony to celebrate, but we need someone priest-like to officiate. Could you look for someone priest-like for us? Priest-like, huh? Mm. If we're looking for people devout enough to have a priest-like person, I'd suggest the Zora. Good luck, you need it. This seems like a real long shot. Oh, and one last wrinkle. Yeah, in accordance to the official boss construction policy that someone's name must say his son. He doesn't have to work for Bolson. If you run into anyone that fits with that what I said, send him here and to tear it down for me. Only the Goron had to work for God for uh, the construction company. And now there are two people that I can talk to. I can't bring either one. There's a specific, but I 
can talk to another. Okay, can I bring? Ah, uh, here I can. Oh. Uh. But I should be able to use my bike outside. What happens if I use it outside and then bring it here? I think I'm missing a picture of a bow. A silver bow. No. I don't remember this guy here. Singing. You seem to have defeated the guardians that appear in a planet so random. Did I imagine you would be able to conquer the same trial as being I suppose that is why you have earned the title of champion. Please accept my congratulations. Here, get some. Yes, sir. Nothing to report, sir. Thank you for appeasing the Divine Beast for Rotten. Now I can have some peace of mind and return to my mission. Did you understand for me? Your name? Master Link. Indeed, my name is Getson. What about it? I'm looking for you. It seems to me that you have something on your mind. Care to tell? Care to let me? Yes, yes, I see. Someone whose name ends with Sun, who can also act as a priest. Is that what you seek? Uh. I'm sorry, Mr. Link. I am a bloodstained soldier. I can never be a priest. Huh. Come on, how many priests are bloodstained? Uh, but back in the domain, there is Capson, who was a priest in the past. Capson should be in the sleeping chamber. Why don't you go visit him? Hang on, I want to see what happens if I try to... Oh. Interesting. I don't suppose I can use a ramp or something. I know where there's a long sword, a small sword, and a shield, but I don't know where there's a bow here. Uh, if during your travels you meet any engaged couples, I would like you to introduce them to me. Joining two souls is a true honor, one I shall stake my life on. Just one more wedding and I shall be fulfilled. Get a load of this. I have been waiting to hear those words. Those specific words? Now, please, uh, tell me the specifics. Uh, as for the location, um, there in town, in Akala. Akala isn't too far from here. It will, it will please me... Uh, it will please me to hurry there right away. By yourself? No need to worry about me. I have always had confidence in my fins and feet. Uh, it has been a long while since I, I have had work. I am eager to put my skills to good use. You should come as well. I will start my preparations in their town in the meantime. And that's the last one. Now, it's just the ceremony. Oh, from his perspective, it was all in a single day. So they, they built a town from the ground up in a single day. And the last two are built now. So the couple of the kids there, we can have another home for the old couple, one for Pat and Grayson, one for once the inn, Grantel lives in the other one, and let's say the ones for 
Batson and Ronson. So Faison needs to sleep at the inn. No, same thing. Okay. Okay, you guys don't care. Link, are you in need of a good sleep and a hearty meal? No. Make kindness of the goddess highly happy with you. I thought so. Thanks to the benevolence of the Highly Goddess, I can offer you a place to stay. I would like me to wake you. No, never mind. He doesn't actually talk about how he set himself here. And uh, Grante is probably here. Nice to meet you. I'm Grante, a dashing novice researcher of ancient civilizations. I've still got a lot to learn for. That's why my father told me to go out and see the world. Mm. Are you also making your way through the world? Something like that. Ah. Oh, you too, huh? I'm sad myself, Lee. Anyway, you must have come a very long way to get here. Hey, how about, as a reward, I let you buy my ultra rare armor at a decent price. Uh, sound like a good deal? Mm. I'm sure you'll find good use for it, usually. Show me the goods. <laughs> Looking to get a set of rare armor in stock. It's called uh, Climb Something or Other. I think I'm still missing one piece. Oh. Complete set of rare gear called Barbarian Something or Other. <laughs> I got a complete set of this rare gear. It's rubber something something. Here you go. Shirt. I'm here. No, maybe I got it at all. Same boots, no boots. Oh, aren't those super rare and the ones I, I got are the last ones made before the guy died? Check it out, Fitch. Phantasma. Yep. I haven't break my so it has been armed, my Highland shoot, so he's still the same. He's still not silent. Oh I'm all done breaking rocks. I was told to stay here. Is something supposed to happen? Hyrule Castle doesn't work. Vasak, did you need me for something? Savak? <laughs> yes, yeah, Savak, that is correct. Oh, maybe you already heard, but Hudson and I are engaged. Oh, yeah, I didn't come to talk to you. What? <laughs> are you surprised? Hudson isn't all the great at things besides his chosen profession, but. I guess that isn't a huge, huge deal, is it? You should talk to him if you want to know more. Hey. Uh, you found Zora. Thank you, really. Uh, he and I talked early, uh, and he said that he literally was a priest before he retri retired. You can't get more priest-like than that. And his name's Capson, so I have no objections there. It really is amazing that you were able to find someone pretty like who also had an acceptable, acceptable name. Mm. Well, next is, uh huh. Of course, we will have to invite guests in order to hold the ceremony. Guests, 
Oh, I'm thinking about my boss, Bolson, and my cybernate, Carson. I see. However, I've got to prepare for the ceremony, so my hands are full. Could you invite them for me? Where are they? You know where they are. The boss and Carson are in Hateno Village, right? I see. Excellent, I'm coming on you. So, Hateno. Hello there. Uh, Mr. Hans just left not so long ago. <laughs> Where? This place not uh, uh, helping. Okay. It doesn't really matter there. Hey. Wait, what? Hudson's getting married and he wants me to attend the wedding. Wow, good on him. Okay though. I mean, wedding time, baby. Not like there's anything to do here anyway. Well, I guess I'll get packed and head towards Hudson's place. Please. Uh, this will be fun. Okay, though. Carson, we are headed out. Finally, we've been waiting for this day. For this day, the day they. Head out. Let's see here. I'm gonna take this one from the wall. And <laughs> yeah, it sounds great. And let's place this one. And they have to return to. I'm keeping that here for now. Um, this one doesn't fit well in any of those. It should be there. I don't know, I think... I'm gonna take this one out. And then later I'll place the the ancient bowl over there. There's something interesting about Carson that we can only know here. He mentioned his girlfriend sometimes, but only with his dialogue here you get to realize who she is. Oh, what's that? Good day. I just met with Hudson, so now I'm feeling pretty relaxed. That reminds me, have you already met Hudson's fiance? Not yet. Oh, really? She's a real beauty, and apparently she's an amazing tailor too. All those clothes she sells, she makes them herself. You know, my girlfriend also works in a clothing shop, although it's her father making all the clothes they sell. So his girlfriend is the the one behind the door at the clothing shop. Uh, fantastic, best, something like that. Uh, I guess it doesn't matter. Oh. Yeah, that sounds just quite lovely. All, all that's left now is to wait for the wedding ceremony. I wonder if it's gonna start soon. Mm. Higher. We're here. Talk to Hudson and let the let's this let's get the ceremony started. 
Oh, hang on. I should probably... Let's keep the surge. Um, mm, mm, mm. This should be well dressed. Um, does this look? No, it looks weird. Well, I suppose you can be fancier than this. Ah, charge attack stamina app. I didn't notice. Yeah, okay. I think I'm properly dressed for a way. I shall scroll it on those lines. Uh, sad. <laughs> uh, so there's the idea of the HHS. Never mind, talk shots. Oh, let's get started. Ooh. Hey. Uh, you extended my invitation for me. Thank you. Now then, Carson and the boss Bolson are waiting for things to begin. Shall we start the ceremony? Of course. Understood. Then let's join the gathering. Silence, please, everyone. We shall now begin. We are gathered here today to join Hudson and Ronson in matrimony. Hudson, before the eyes of those of these witness, uh, witnesses and before those of God's, Goddess Hylia, do you take Ronson to be your wife, to take and to hold in good times and in bad? I do. Excellent. And Ronson, before the eyes of these witnesses and before those of Goddess Hylia, do you take Hudson as your lawfully wedded husband in sickness and in wealth, health? And do you also vow to name your children in accordance with the Boston Construction naming guidelines? Mm -hmm. At a moment. Those vows are not traditional by anyone's standards. What makes you say that? They are as traditional as it gets. I don't think she means traditional in that sense of the word. A vow of undying tradition. And a vow of guidelines compliance. I'll take that vow. Think of future generations. Oh, those are the guidelines. I do. Excellent. Uh, and so, dearly beloved, please help me in greeting this newly married couple. I wish this new couple nothing but the utmost happiness as they set out on this journey of very helpless. Yeah, they could have... I mean, the town could be even bigger and they could have a child by the second game. A sack, did you something? Sack. <laughs> Yes, that's correct. Mm -hmm. The wedding ceremony wasn't what I expected, but it was special all the same. Did you like the dress? I made it myself. No kidding. Although Hudson wanted me to weave the gems in my into it, and uh, so every step down the yeah, <laughs> aisle was a struggle. Well, that's life for you. With all its twists and turns, I hope you stick with us through them. Ooh. Hey, it's you. Thank you for attending the ceremony. <laughs> I replied. What? No, just something in my eye. 
and now Terry Town looks like a real town as a long last. This was all possible because of you. I can't thank you enough for all the hard work you did. Alright, this is for you. Uh, these were found inside the borders we smashed when we were clearing lanes. On some I have no use for them. You can take them. Hello. Two, on some are very happy to live here now. So, isn't there something important that you should be doing? Yeah. Then get to it. You travel the world helping folks, but there's more than need. There's more than need helping. You don't have the luxury of tearing here. Terry. Hello. It's you. I... Is there something important you should be doing? No. I see. In that case, stay as long as you like, okay? Uh, anything? Him as well. Yo! I was just staying around when a wedding started out of nowhere. It took me by surprise. I know Hudson for ages and he... A whole day. <laughs> and he never said a word about it. Can you believe that? Uh, well... It was nice, a nice wedding ceremony. I guess all's well that it's well. Oh. Yeah, it was a nice wedding ceremony. Well then, there's nothing left more for me to do here, so I'm gonna take it easy. Uh, yeah, it would be nice to keep me here. But, yeah, they're gonna go back to my ah. home, are they? You were really helpful in getting this town in shape. It's in the shape it's now. Weren't you? Hudson is really great. Oh. I can tell. Wherever and wherever I meet you, uh, you're no ordinary man. Oh. Hey there. The bride and groom were so lovely, weren't they? Indeed. Mm -hmm. Love. It's such a sublime, precious thing, you know? My best wishes to the couple. Now that the wedding is over, we should probably head back to Hatton Village. Well then, Hi. Carson, we're going home. Oh. Okay. Oh. <laughs> My camera finally crashed for good. No?